Hi, I'm Julia M. Spencer, real estate advisor, investor, and enthusiast. And I'm standing here in front of the house that's in my neighborhood. I actually had a chance to buy this house about a week ago. Uh, actually, maybe a couple weeks ago. But um, this is one of those deals where I was just a little bit too late. Um, I tried to find a private money investor, private money lender to buy it. And when I contacted the original owner, because they had offered to sell it to me about a month ago, um, I, I hadn't secured my investor yet, and so I wasn't able to purchase it. Um, instead, a young family came in and they made an offer, and um, they just closed on this house last Monday, and they moved in. But here's a couple lessons to be learned from this. One of the things is you got to watch your neighborhood. You got to get talking to the neighbors. You got to get the neighbors to come to you and offer you deals, so you don't have to search for them. In this case, if I had been a little bit quicker. I could have saved the original seller the 6%, which could have secured me the 6% realtor seller's fee, which could have secured me basically a better deal on this house. Also, because they sold it within one week to this other family, that means they were already under 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 price. And then I found out from other neighbors later on that the original owner actually didn't have a clue how to price this house and was asking the other neighbors. So I could have gotten a really good deal in this house, but I didn't because I was too late. Um, now the good part about this story is that in the future, um, I actually have already introduced myself to this family. They, they're a young family, um, young family, no children. The, the husband, he's in the military, um, which tells me he's going to be here maybe a few years and then probably he's going to get transferred someplace else. That's my thinking. So I'm going to be watching this house and whenever somebody transfers on a job or leaves and um, I don't want to advocate getting into other people's business or anything but I kind of like to know what's going on in my neighborhood or the neighborhoods where I'm investing. So I'm going to be watching this house and when it comes time for them to transfer or, or make a move or um, which is undoubtedly going to happen um, then I'm going to be standing by and hopefully get this house as a dis at a discount prior to them having to list it with a realtor and uh, the price being all jacked up high. So um, so those are the kinds of things that I watch for. Those are the kinds that you, things that you can learn from me. Um, go visit my website. It's www.juliamspencer.com. M stands for money. Download your free guide to real estate investing and um, sign up for my newsletter. Thank you. For your free guide to real estate investing, visit juliammspencer.com.